Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Lisa of Diamonds and Stitches and today I have another unpackaging. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what's in here. Um, it's wrapped in a boot and while I did order quite a few things from AliExpress and CES deals and I got a bunch of notifications but I don't know what's in this package and I don't know why it would be in a boot because the things that I got in a boot um, were, I would have thought might have been the storage cases, but I unboxed those yesterday or unpackaged those yesterday. And, um, and so yeah, so we don't know what this is. So let's get you guys down so we can um, have a look and yeah, and see what I got. <laughs> okay, so this is the way it came. Um, package. Uh, it was in my mailbox. Um, I was pleasantly surprised when I went to go get my mail on Monday and inside my mailbox were two keys for the bigger mailboxes and um, both of them were jam-packed with packages. So, whoops, sorry. Um, so, let's try and get this open. So, it is truly in a boot. Um, yeah, so it came packaged in their wonderful bag, whatever system they call this. <gasps> oh my gosh, you know what this is? Oh, I did not expect this to come already. Oh my goodness. Okay, e sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's just untape that. Okay, so you guys, this is another storage case. Oh my word. I didn't think that this was coming yet. And in fact, oh, it does say... <laughs> Maybe I should have paid more attention. Okay, so I bought this from the Moon Crescent Official Store, and it is an 84 um, leather, you know, PVC, fake leather, um, diamond painting uh, bag, accessory bag, and I paid $24.53 for this um for this case. Now I saw somebody unbox this. Sorry, I'm gonna get rid of that notification. Um, I saw somebody unbox this. I apologize. I don't remember who who it was. Um, but as they were, oh my goodness. There we go. Sorry about the noise, guys. As they were unboxing it. All I could think of was how it could be improved on. Um, so, okay, so this is, it's got a little handle. It looks like a little makeup case, right? And I'm all about cute storage things. Like, I will tell you honestly, I have actually bought tea at Tivana um, that used to have a store here in, in uh, one of our malls. And um, they used to have the cutest tins to put the loose tea in. Well, because I wanted the tin, because it was so stinking cute, I had to buy the tea. So um, <laughs> it wasn't buy the tea and then get this cute. No, no, I wanted the tin because it was adorbs. And so I am all about like packaging and storage and it, it really packaging. <laughs> I know, sad. So, um, so when I saw this, and um on ally express and they were like new storage solutions right and everybody knows how i feel about let's see if i have it here how i feel about my storage cases right my hard sided storage cases well the biggest they come is 60. so when i saw this puppy and it said it had 84 four bottles to it I was like yes please so let's open it up same kind of zipper it is hard it's a nice hard case so um that's awesome and seriously it looks like like one of those little train makeup cases you know um that that they okay the smell oh my goodness well you can definitely tell it's fake fake plastic Wee hoo! all right that's going out into the into the garage for some for some airing out okay so cute right cute so inside it has trays 
on the top it has a tray of bottles now this one got a little squished and I'm gonna have to do some repair on it it looks like um, so here let's take it out now I find it interesting that the top bottles are a different color than the bottom bottles interesting and these ones were in there upside oh okay well these were in there upside down weird okay so oh I'm not even in frame sorry guys sorry okay so these little bottles they're teeny weeny and then these are the bigger ones you guys see that should have something behind me maybe to well so you see the difference there's a big difference now what I find interesting is look at the caps the opaque cap or more frosted and the clear cap I find it interesting that they use two different caps in the same in the same case okay so four one two three four five six seven seven times four is seven fourteen twenty eight so there's twenty eight bottles on the top um and they go in the top of this case now this looks like stickers oh and they're nice teeny tiny tiny can you guys see that they're teeny tiny i love these love these and these are going to good use though so, oh there's some more i was gonna say I can't see that being enough stickers for <laughs> for that. So, okay, I'm gonna try and shove this back in there. Um, there, no, there we go. This is a nice tight fit, way tighter fit. And also interesting, it's going to be a little difficult to get the bottles out from the corner, it looks like, because they really squished down in there. Okay, all right. Now, in order to get the tray out of this, you have to actually take out a bottle and then pull this out, okay? And then there's another tray in the bottom. Again, if you want to get that bottom out, you're going to need to pull it out. There we go. And then there's the bottom. Okay, so this is what I see as the problem with this case. I think that having these bottles is awesome. Having this amount of bottles is awesome. I love the storage part of the case. This is what I would have liked to have seen. Either that there was a zipper along the side here so that it could open up and you could pull the trays out from the side um, it would be a lot easier than trying to pick the tray out from the top. Um, you know that's kind of a pain in the butt now four one two three four five six seven yep seven so again there's 28 um bottles in each in each um section each tier i guess you could call it and um which is nice and the, like i said these are the nice big ones the really nice big ones now if we look at that case that i bought yesterday and remember how I said, if you watch this video, I said that there seemed to be several different types of cases. Ooh, I think I even have my first case down here as well. Ooh, I do. Un momento, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to link all of these cases um, and where I bought them because they are all different bottles okay so from the very very first one i bought and i want to say i got this from amazon i'm gonna have to double check that um but i'm going to link it below this is the bottle so you see it's a little bit it's a little bit more round it's a little bit more uh cylindrical shaped and then the top 
has a domed lid. It's more domed, it's more raised on the top. The second one that I got, um, very similar, it's more, uh, it's, it seems to be taller. It is taller, but not as, uh, not as wide. Yep, definitely not as wide. So there's the difference. Um, and taller and a flat top. Now this one that I received from the makeup case has the same type of bottle, but has different um, tops to them. Same, same nice flat top, but one is see-through and one is opaque. Um, so there must be, so now I'm thinking there's three different styles of bottles. There's the shorter, more cylindrical round with a domed top. There's the tall, uh, taller version with a flat top and a clear top. There's the tall with a opaque top. And then there's the teeny weeny bottle that is about uh, about half the size. Yeah, about half the size of um, of the bigger bottle. So um, yeah, I, I find that interesting that um, I guess maybe depending on the manufacturer, the store that you buy from from Ally Express and or Amazon, though if I bought it from Amazon it still came from China it still took quite a while to get here which I might have to back that up I'm not sure but regardless I'm going to link all of the information in the description below so um now if I'm going to be honest this one with the domed lid is the one I like the best I love these domed lids. I like the size of the bottle. They just feel a lot more sturdy um, and they seem to be a little bit more uh, thicker of a plastic versus these ones. There's nothing wrong with these, but they're a little bit, um, they're just a little thinner of a plastic, I guess, maybe because they're taller. Um, they don't quite seem to have the same um, thickness in the bottom even of the of the case. Now they're sturdy. I've been using them for a really long time. I don't have any problems with um, breakage or anything. But so back to this guy here. What I do find a little annoying is I think the concept is great, but if you have a diamond painting that has, you know, 70 colors to it, um, I don't know that I've ever had one yet, but it, I don't think that it's beyond the realm of possibility, right? Um, but if you do have one that is definitely going to use more than 24, because this is 24 bottles, and you need to go to that next layer down, well, obviously you're going to pull out the top layer and then, you know, just grab your bottles from the bottom layer. But, um in order for it to come out, you are going to need to remove a few bottles at best to get the foam out. And I'm going to say that the foam on the corner here, there's not a lot of it in the corners. There's a lot more on the side here, these two ones here, but on the corners, that foam's pretty flimsy. And I'm guessing that that's so that they can get it into the corners of the, you know, the case and not be super bulky. But if that's how you're going to take it out, I can see this not lasting for a long time, the foam, and so eventually could rip. I like that they have individual holes for the case, the bottles to go into because then they don't rub up on, against each other, less scratching, less chance of breakage or cracking or anything like that. So I like that they have an individual home for each bottle, but um, if you are going to need to, you know, pick it out all the time to get to the bottles underneath, um, I, I do see this as a flaw. 
I love the case. I think that it's cute. I do. I think that it's really, really cute. And, and again, I'm all about storage. And what I like is these top ones, dang, they're sturdy. Like you, they're not moving. They're not coming out. So that's awesome until you pick them out. Um, so that, that's nice. That is nice. Okay. Well, actually with all that movement, they did come down a little bit, but nothing fell out. And that was pretty, that was a lot of movement. Um, Okay, the other thing that I do like is that when you zip this, the top and these ones are not resting against each other. And in fact, you have a little bit of space in here. And I'm betting, I don't have any down here with me, but I'm betting that you could put some drill pens and whatever in the top. Again, I probably won't because I don't want, you know, scratches on the top of my cases plus, or bottles, plus I put the um, labels on the top of my bottles and with, you know, stuff rubbing up against and whatever, they'll either get mucked up or whatever. I'm a little OCD about that, I guess. So, um, but yeah, so would I buy this again? Probably not unless there was a uh, improvement on how to get the bottles out of the case. And again, my suggestion would be like either a little zipper or something so that, you know, you could push it to the side and take the, um, you know, or at the very least, like have a zipper so that it flopped over or something to that effect so that you were able to retrieve the slide out the, the, uh, trays. Um, but yeah, so Moon, what did I say it was? Moon Crescent, Moon Crescent official store. I paid $24.53. I ordered it on July 18th and it was here. Well, I got it out of my bail, mailbox on July 29th. It could have been in there for a few days because I had not gotten my mail over uh, the weekend. And, um, and so it could potentially have been there for a few days. So I'm going to say the 29th regardless. That's 11 days, you guys. 11 days that it got to me from China. So pretty awesome. All right. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little review. It is a very cute case. I am going to use it. And um, if my granddaughter, you know, continues on her path, um, to diamond painting. She's going to love this because of the pattern inside, you know, the little leopard print. And I mean, it's just a super cute storage and, um, with it zippering a zipper on it and a handle. It's a super cute, super cute presentation for your, um, diamond painting bottles storage case. So I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.